Magic, an autumn forest in the Kashubian region in northern Poland. Graphic, a snow-covered storage facility near Gdansk. Mysterious, the city of Sandomish during a flood. Abstract landscapes, captured from a bird's eye view with a digital single lens reflex camera. That's the trademark of Polish photographer Kacper Kowalski. I'm just taking the simple observation from above. Those pictures are about uh, features of our uh, civilization. So this is like a portrait of civilization on example of Polish landscape. Kowalski worked as an architect for four years. Then he decided to pursue his two great passions, flying and photography. He quit his job and began taking professional aerial photographs. Whenever he can, Kowalski flies over his country in a gyroplane, an open cockpit mini helicopter. He has to prepare his flights carefully and do regular maintenance on the aircraft. Sometimes it's a long wait before the light and the weather are right. The weather is unpredictable and uh, the forecast was good and uh, we should able to fly, but uh, it's raining, so, uh, so I can fly. Uh, but uh, it will be the same pleasure like uh, riding motorcycle in the rain, so you can do it, but uh, it's not uh, comfortable. Once he's up in the sky, it's a kind of meditation. Another world, accessible only from the air, opens up. The 37-year-old photographer revisits some sites again and again in different seasons or at different times of day, like this beach on Poland's Baltic Sea coast. Kowalski's pictures tell little stories about the relationship between humans and nature. When I will see uh, some feature of human activation, it can be at the beach, in the forest, in the winter, uh, some sign imprinted in the landscape, then this is the interesting thing for me. And humans uh, leave uh, traces all the time, and this is amazing. Kowalski has always been interested in places that are difficult to find and access. Industrial facilities, chemical plants, open cast mines. He flies over them and photographs things that no one would otherwise see. In 2014, he received a World Press Award for a selection of these pictures that he titled Toxic Beauty. I wanted to show to people places that are like a cost of our uh, comfortable life because we have uh, energy in the cable uh, in our house and this means that somewhere uh, this energy should be uh, have to be produced. Toxic Beauty shows those places, those places that we would like to push out from our imagination and our, uh, our emotions. The interface between humans and landscape is the focus of Kowalski's new book called Side Effects. He consciously left out any explanations of the photos beyond their GPS coordinates. And this is the similar situation uh, that I have during my flights. Because I fly above the ground, I see the landscape, and there is no caption on the ground. And uh, this is the situation uh, of uh, discovering places with me. I can, somebody can fly with me through my book. Katzper Kowalski's way of looking at things turns everyday landscapes into little stories, and sometimes into riddles. In April, an exhibition of his new pictures will open in New York. <laughs>